Hi, here's a short introduction to the readings for Thursday, November 16th. Uh, for Thursday, we're going to be reading and discussing one of my all-time favorite thinkers about climate change, Suzanne Mosier, and uh, a student of hers, a Stanford PhD student named Carol Berzonski. It's never been easy to communicate about climate change, and now as climate change has become more than an abstract matter of science, uh, it's, it's really a lived reality. It's a good time to ask how we might more effectively communicate about this topic, a topic that many people find threatening. Uh, in the reading, uh, they start off by recognizing that, that, is, that there's a significant challenge, the growing politicalization of science and ideology uh, that has polarized the U.S. population around the topic of climate change. And they ask, are there openings for meaningful, constructive communication among people who differ on this topic? And that seems like a challenging issue, doesn't it? So here are, here are some questions that I think would be helpful for you to consider as you, as you read this chapter. First, how would you summarize American attitudes on climate change today? Uh, what do the polls tell us Americans believe? Uh, another question would be, what is the missing middle? Who are these folks in the missing middle? And do they really exist? How do, they, how do the uh, authors suggest that um, these folks might be better engaged in the discussion about climate change? And what's this notion of a discourse continuum? Does this framing of, of the issue make, make sense to you of a discourse continuum? And finally, um, what do the authors suggest is the best way forward? Is it really about dialogue? Why would you th think that people who disagree so much about climate change would actually engage in a topic, a, a dialogue about this topic? So those are the questions. Um, characterize your American attitudes. What's the missing middle? What's this discourse continuum? And uh, what's the way forward? We'll look forward to seeing you on Thursday and engaging in this topic. See you then. Bye.